In this video, how to use OBS Virtual Cam with Zoom and Meet, as an example, for lower thirds, on-screen graphics and other tools in your video meetings. What you will need here is the Open Broadcast software and the OBS Virtual Cam, and the examples here is Google Meet and Zoom Video Meetings. You can use any service. Remember, OBS and the OBS Virtual Cam is open source and free. So what does it look like in our fictitious world if we take this lovely looking lady who is organising a business meeting? She could be a student as well. Let's give her a fictitious name of Laura Lynette from Mer Models. Now what you'll notice that she's in the meeting at the moment, she's got a lower third there and if she wishes to get a bit more serious about it and say, look, find me on Twitter, here is the lower third, all done and dusted. We go back and then we can add other extra things like have a look at my fashion designs all inside the virtual cam here and we've got components of webcam with the lovely Laura we've got the lower third and we've also got a picture in picture all set up the lower third itself I've made from a Google slides download as a transparent PNG to get started with this if you are new to OBS, you'll need to go to OBS Project and download the software for Windows, Mac or Linux. After that, go and Google OBS Virtual Webcam Plugin and then you will arrive at OBS Virtual Cam 2.0.5. Download that, which is incredibly fast and quick, and then open it up. When you get into OBS itself, you will have a setting like this. Again, I repeat, if you're brand new to OBS, it's very, very easy to use and it's completely free. On the left, we've got our preview and on the right, we've got whatever comes into the live situation. In other words, if you are recording like I am now, streaming, or in this example, going to our virtual cam. When you add something, just go back up one slide, from the sources, there's a plus button. When you click that plus button, you can add anything you like into your virtual setup. In this example, I've added a couple of uh, media things and a webcam. You can see the list there. I repeat again, if you're new to OBS, I've got loads of videos on that to go and learn that. So to start the OBS virtual cam and get it into Zoom and Meet, we will do nothing more than top tools, virtual cam, start, where you can select in this example, Zoom, choose the video source of OBS dash camera and boom, you are done. If you are in Google Meet, then you can choose exactly the same video source of OBS dash camera. Notice in Meet that you get a mirror in image, but the audience sees it round the right way. From a stock image of the Google Meet website, we've got a bunch of people in a meeting and you can see how, uh, no disrespect to fictitious Spencer Casey down here, maybe he's a real person, but if Laura Lynette joins from my models, you can see her name much, much bigger as that example. So quite honestly, this was a fast look at how to use OBS Virtual Cam with Zoom and Meet for lower thirds on-screen graphics and other tools with our lovely, lovely thanks to Laura Lynette from Mer Models uh, showing off some of her fashion designs. That was me, Mike Downs. See you in the next one.